Hello, fellow 5M enthusiasts. Welcome back to another exciting development journey. In today's video, we have something special for you, a free script that allows you to add the Cat Cafe job to your server. This unique and fun job will surely delight your players and bring a new level of enjoyment to your server. But before we dive into the details, make sure to hit that like button, share this video with your fellow developers, and subscribe to stay updated with more fantastic 5M scripts and enhancements. Also, keep in mind that to fully enjoy the Cat Cafe job, you'll need to purchase the YMAP from the Gab's website. I'm Brave, and let's get started with adding the Cat Cafe job to your server. To kickstart this exciting journey, head over to the GitHub download page. You can find the link conveniently placed in the video description below. Download the files and unzip the folder. Inside the unzipped folder, you'll see another folder. Copy this folder and place it into your desired location within your server's resources directory. Now let's go back to the GitHub page and copy the items listed in the README file. Next, navigate to QB Core shared items in your server folder and paste these items anywhere you like. You can follow along with the video for a visual guide. Now return to the script folder and open the images folder. Copy all the images inside and paste them into QB inventory HTML images. Again, you can refer to the video for a step-by-step -step demonstration. Back on the GitHub page, copy the shared jobs code, as demonstrated in the video. This will create the UU job. Paste these lines into QB Core shared jobs. Now we need to add animation code to make everything work smoothly. Make sure you have the DPMotes script installed on your server. Simply copy the lines from the GitHub page, then navigate to Deepemotes client and paste them at the end of the file, as shown in the video. With all the installation steps complete, it's time to put everything to the test and see how it all functions in action. If you check the config file, you find the location of market stock PD. This is where you can specify the place where players buy all the stock for the Cat Cafe. Simply adjust the coordinates in the config to move them to a different location as needed for your server setup. Now let's take a look at the cafe. You'll notice there are plenty of adorable cats around, adding to the cozy atmosphere. If you step inside, you'll find a fridge where you can store all the purchased stock. For this video, I'm going to move the stock guy inside the store for convenience. Now let's try making a product. Gather the correct ingredients and head to the stove to start the preparation process. Once it's done, you can simply put it into the stash so the front person can collect it from there. The front person can then complete the billing transaction and provide the food to the customer through the front desk stash. Right next to the front counter, we have something that could turn you into a real business mogul, a coffee machine. But this isn't just any ordinary coffee machine. It's a money-making machine with seven different items that could potentially make you rich. Forgot to mention, in order to start working the cat cafe job, you'll need to clock in first. My apologies for missing that detail. I forgot to mention that, 
Currently, the script doesn't have a dependency for QB management. However, I've added the dependency for QB management myself. To add the boss menu, you'll also need to add the coordinates to the QB management config as shown in the video. But keep in mind that just adding the coordinates isn't enough. You'll need to connect the Cat Cafe client and QB management. For this, you can join my team's Discord and ask for the code in the QB support section. Also, if you have any ideas to add new features to this script, feel free to reach out to my team. Alright, that brings us to the end of this video. We've successfully added the Cat Cafe job to our server, allowing players to enjoy a unique and immersive role-playing experience. But, as always, there's more we can do to enhance the script. Here's a to-do list for future improvements. Adding an oven to the cat cafe for more diverse food preparation. Optimizing the stock location to make it more efficient for the players. Introducing a hand wash mechanic for hygiene. Implementing a food cutting process as part of the preparation. These are just a few ideas to take this script to the next level. If you have any suggestions or questions, don't hesitate to drop them in the comments below. And if you found this video helpful, please hit the like button, share it with your fellow developers, and subscribe for more exciting 5M content. I'm Brave, and I'll catch you in the next video, where we'll explore more fantastic scripts and enhancements for your 5M server. Until then, happy developing! And for all you developers out there, be sure to support my development community by joining our team Discord, which you can find in the description below. We are a group of experienced developers with over four years of experience, having managed servers with 400 plus players simultaneously in-game. Whether you're a map builder or scripter, you're welcome to join our community of 150 plus developers where you can discuss errors, improvements, and thrive in your development journey. Thanks for watching and happy scripting.